So we all know how Google's Nano Banana literally took the world by storm because of its hyper-realistic images. Well, they also dominated the AI image editing space because of how good the prompt understanding is. Well, we just got Nano Banana Pro, and it's insane. It has upgraded quality being able to reach 4K, and also improves on other areas like prompt understanding for image editing, and way better reference image gen, where you combine multiple images to create one. And to access it, we would be using a platform you've probably heard of before, because they are always the first to implement the latest AI models. Now they are running a sale where you can get unlimited Nano Banana Pro generations, so stay tuned for that and stick around because this is a real improvement. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe for more AI content like this. If you want to learn how to make money with AI and AI influencers, subscribe to my other channel and let's get started. Okay, guys. So this is the name of the tool that we use to access it and it's called Higgs Field AI. We all know this tool, but as always, the link will be in the description. Now, this is an all-in-one AI tool that was one of the first to actually push out Sora 2 and Sora 2 Pro and they've done it once again, but with Nano Banana. Now we all know Nano Banana has been one of the best, if not the best, image gen and image editing model out there. And now they have released Nano Banana Pro. And also they're currently running a promo where you can get unlimited Nano Banana Pro generations. So stay tuned to hear more about that later in the video. But first of all, let's get into it. As you can see, this is the Nano Pro gallery. Over here is the visual effects for different tools, but yeah, let's just simply go and start to use it. So then we'll be presented with this interface. And just so you know, I'm not capping. Over here, as you can see, we are using the Nano Banana Pro model. Okay, let's start with a very simple prompt, something like this. So we have this prompt and it's relatively simple. Um, not that descriptive, but yeah, let's select the aspect ratio. And I think 16 by nine is okay. And as you can see, this can go all the way to 4K quality, but let's leave it at 2K. And for the batch size, I actually suggest increasing this batch size to two. We could then just click on generate. Okay, so in no time at all, it's done generating. Let's take a look at this one. And this looks amazing. No morphing whatsoever. This looks hyper realistic. Now I know why this has been trending. Let's take a look at this other one. And this also looks perfect. I think both of them look perfect. We can go over here to edit in canvas, delete and download it. I think we should do that and we can also do a whole lot more. Okay, now you see that it does well with simple prompts. Now let's put in something a bit more complex, okay? So we have this prompt here, and as always, we are using Nano Banana Pro in 2K. Then let's click on Generate and see how it does. As you can see, it's in a queue. So in no time at all, both of them are done generating, and we can take a look at them. I think this one looks really nice. This other one also looks really, really nice and also realistic. And on prompt two, both of them are so prompt accurate, so very prompt accurate, you can go over here to download it. Now let's put in another complex prompt. Okay, so we have this prompt here. You guys might recognize this prompt when we're done generating it, but it is quite complex with a specific camera angle and how the shot is taken. So let's simply click on generate and see how this handles it. Okay, it's done cooking and let's take a look at it. And this looks nice, realistic, and consistent. Also prompt accurate. This really shows me how good Nano Banana is. And I preferred this second one simply because of the motion blur it's added here. So it's just more prompt accurate. Then we can go over here and download this. This is just amazing. Now I think we should try another complex prompt. So let's say something like this. So we do have a prompt like this and it actually looks really nice. Then we could change the aspect ratio to something like two by three, or let's change it to nine by 16 since this is basically for our AI influencer. And let's click on generate and let's see how it does. Okay, so it is done generating and we can take a look at both of them. So this one looks nice. As you can see, it is amazing. And this one is also good. Both of them are prompt accurate, which I really like. Okay, so I think I prefer something like this and I can go over here to download it. Now for the editing parts, we can simply go here and click and we can either click here to edit the prompts or instruct it to change something. Let's say something like this. So we have something like this. But first of all, let's change this aspect ratio to 16 by nine and click on generate. Okay guys, so it's done generating. Now let's take a look at this. Yeah, this one looks nice, but this is why I said you should generate two images because this second one is just simply perfect. Okay, so let's move on. So as you can see, we have this here and let's simply try to edit it by saying something like this. So we have this. And as always, leave the batches at two and click on generate. Okay guys, so it's done generating. And as you can see, 
there are the two images here. And once again, this is why I advise you to always generate more than one image. Because as you can see, this one is good actually, but it failed to transform these two front cars. But this one on the other hand, transformed all the main cars in the frame into tanks. So this is just better. You can go over to download this. Now, in case you are wondering, yes, this is multimodal, meaning we can go over here and add an image. And as you can see, we can upload up to 14 images and it'll get the context. So let's simply just upload an image first to edit. Okay, so we've uploaded this image here. You can take a look at it. We have, this is the image that we've uploaded. And let's simply put in a prompt like this. So we have this prompt here, and as you can see, it literally changes her mood, and let's simply click Generate. Okay, so it's done generating, and this is what it generated. And this one looks really nice. I mean, both of them, in my opinion, look just perfect. They look almost the same. And one thing I would like to note is, other than the fact that it was able to accurately change the things we asked it to change, like the top, it also changed the facial expression, and it still kept it so consistent. It did a really good job with the facial expression, so we can go ahead to download this. And remember, you can upload multiple images, not just one. Okay, so as you can see, I uploaded these other two images here, and I can say something like, she's wearing the headphones while drinking from the can, and it should understand which of the images is the headphones and the can. And as you can see, it's the same image that we use to edit this. So let's simply click here on generate. Um, okay, so as you can see, it's done generating and this looks amazing. I mean, completely amazing. Both of them look amazing. And I love how Nano Banana Pro correctly understood which is the can and which is the headphones. And it implemented both of them into the image so seamlessly. It did a very good job. Okay then, so let's clear this and let's try something a bit more complex. As you can see, this can hold up to 14 images, so I wanna upload some more images. Okay, so as you can see, we have all of these images. Then we can put in a prompt like this. So we have this simple prompt here and it would understand all of them. And let's make the aspect ratio to be nine by 16 and click on generate. Okay guys, now take a look at these two images and take a look at every single one of these images on here. Also remember, we could add more. This can take up to 14 images, no sweat, and let's take a look at them. I mean, this has truly blown my mind. Nano Banana Pro is onto something with this. Because as you can see, this image is the perfect one in my opinion, because it somehow still gave her these new clothes and kept the pose, I mean the exact pose of the original image. It got the glasses right, it got the hat right, the shirt, the shoes, even the length of the shoes. It got everything perfectly, and it also got the pose of the model perfectly. Now, in case you don't believe me, Take a look at this. This is the pose of the model, and this is the image generated. It's just so very consistent, which is just insane. This model is really amazing, and they are currently doing a Black Friday sale where you can get unlimited Nano Banana Pro for a whole year. And that is for those who subscribe to Higgs Field. And as you can see here, Higgs Field is literally the lowest priced on the market, and it offers you a whole lot like Sora 2 and VO 3.1. It literally has the best of the best models out there. And there's Nano Banana Pro here, which I don't think you can see in any other platform, and it still has the lowest price on the market. So yeah, be sure to check it out with the link in the description and like, and subscribe for more AI tools like this.